Hello and welcome to Hearts of Iron 4. We are playing as the Baltic Unitary State and from our small beginnings of taking over the small countries there, uh, Latvia and Estonia, we took on Denmark and then Sweden and part of Norway to become, well, that uh, in the last episode. Uh, so we got away with murder last week. Um, but we are not responsible for the murder of an Iranian nuclear scientist, uh, so that's nothing to do with us. Um, okay, well, I think we are just moving into these areas, uh, and if we're not, we should be. Uh, I'm not sure why he's going all the way around there like that. Uh, let's get him doing that and that. Uh, okay, seriously, he's going to do that. I'd rather he did that. That would be better. Um, yeah, we're going to carry on uh, through Iran. Uh, okay. Seriously, uh, that one wants to go back up there. Don't think so. I think probably an attack through to there would be beneficial. Uh, maybe cut these guys off here. Uh, anybody think of that? Uh, on the front lines, but you didn't. An aggression pack from Siam. Do a little number. Never that. Not really. Uh, where are you going? Yeah, that's a good move. That's probably the best move that I've actually seen so far by the computer. Um, yeah, we'll move you in there like that. Uh, so that is our Iran business going on. We have got uh, another troop that are here. So let's just get these organized for this because that's going to be necessary. Um, uh, let's justify while we're at the beginning of the game. So we're not doing a lot else, are we? Are we? Well, we're holding the line in the Suez Canal. Uh, Italy have taken over North Africa. They're taking over, well, maybe their own territory there. Um, we are holding them back in Sicily and not doing a lot with them there. Okay, so we moved off this area, I think. In the last episode so the axis troops are moving in there all right yeah we move them up there so they can tackle those troops there that's fine everywhere else looks nice and quiet um right okay so the yeah axis troops have actually cornered the allied troops there which is good um yeah we've got Tokyo, don't we we have got dockyards. I was doing something with dockyard last week, and did I get a destroyer going? I'm not sure. I think it did, but I think it's just one. And knowing what I'm like, I haven't set this up properly. Uh, okay, we need steel for some reason. Oh no 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 no! no. Close. We can get it from the Russian Empire for thirty for one. Uh, right, yes, Navy. Let's all lock. Right, what do we need to do then? Uh, well, we need to train them. Uh, so we'll do that. Can we get a commander? We can get a commander for free. Yay. Uh, so we need naval experience because we are doing what? We're doing our submarine and we need to add another uh, thing onto our destroyer if I remember rightly. Uh, now, uh, hold on, the enemies have laid 35 mines, damage zero, and sunk zero of our ships. That's because we've only put one ship out there so far. Okay, um, hmm. Okay, uh, right. Um, I'm going to call on you guys to move there, and then you can work out there. You guys are working on that, are you? Okay, uh, can I... P they are only naval bombers, so... Well, we've got CAS out there, so... Attack bombers and interwar bombers. I think I'm going to ask you guys to do a bit of a multi-mission here. Um, I want everything there basically destroyed. Uh, 
I don't like the fact that our ships are going to be training out there. I have no idea what's here, that's the thing. Oh, our enemies have laid 28 mines there. Okay. Hmm. Um, so I'm saying that I don't know what's there, but I have actually got these. So let's put some of those out there. Can we put aircraft there? We can. Let's get some going. Uh, let's see if we can actually find these. Anything that's there. Uh, should we set up some of these guys? Mm, maybe. I don't know. That isn't a lot. But I could tell these guys that I want that. If we get a ship in the area and then we do both areas for or alternate that for that and can I take it off there? I can, okay. Uh, yeah, let's get them training up there. That would be better. Still not sure why it's actually gone to there when it should be here. Or oh, mm, I don't know. We're gonna fill that area with ships and submarines, and we'll see if we can actually get rid of that and then train in peace and quiet. Uh, okay, um, let's start the game. Well, we have started the game, but we've been fiddling so let's stop fiddling it's the 16th of December 1942 so we went nearly a year in the last episode let's see if we can carry that on this episode yeah 35 days that's going to take uh, we are gaining Navy experience though quite quickly just for one ship um, yeah that will help then if they can work and she do something with them. Uh, you're moving into there. Okay, can I shift your attack both into there and then get you guys to do that? I think I can. Uh, you're moving in. Good. Uh, can I get you guys to. Oh, hold on. Um, you're moving somewhere stupid, so let's not have that. Let's have you guys do this. So you've got a trait. Nope. Computer's trying to fool me. Doesn't take a lot. That was pure luck that he actually came across those, but I don't really want those. I want to take that at the end of the day, but I want to reduce these this pocket over on this side. If we can. Okay, right, your front line, well, that's got a bit weird, because they moved in there, that's why, damn it. Okay, um, sure, we will adapt, we will survive. Uh, can you do that instead? Uh, the problem is with Iran's area here, I, I, you can probably see, it's the British Raj that's actually there. Uh, which is why I wanted an area here, or hold on, an area here so that I can actually just push our guys straight into and then cause a front to happen. Uh, yeah, I'd like to be able to get in there without any resistance, please. And then cut these guys off. It's not happening at the moment, though, because they keep on reinforcing with shoddy troops. Shoddy troops. Uh, now keep these going. You go straight into there, sir. Uh, you come all the way through. You come all the way down. I can't get into there. Um, I could.
could push there and there. Is everybody going there? They are indeed. Well, I think one of them is actually moving into. He thinks he's going to go there. Well, I think differently because what I say apparently doesn't go. Um, yep, let's get working on that. You can support that. You can't support that, not yet. Damn it, they put troops there. Uh, right. Legionnaires Bulgaria cancels their land lease. Were they giving us anything? Seriously? Were they? Uh, right, okay. I was. Bill, it, I think I actually did this after the episode had finished. I'm not sure, but I added loads of construction and infrastructure because uh, we need tons of um, factories and military factories as well as infrastructure actually gaining in well this territory as well as others uh, so don't think there's a focus that can actually help me out with well, this one will do infrastructure but it won't do factories that will be repair factories but that's not really what yeah, I'm after so I think that's all a bit naff. Um, what I'm gonna do is launch our efforts elsewhere. Is there any decisions I can do? Uh, move capital to Vilnius. Interesting. Uh, it's currently a Kurnas. We gain stability by doing this, just 10% costs us nothing to do as well. Who would not do that? And war propaganda against the Raj, we're only 66% at the moment. That would actually help us out. By pure fluke and chance, um, we have managed to gain the initiative there. Um, not so much there. See, they've got the, f the port now, so really, Germany, Italy, are you kind of stupid? Take that port back. Otherwise, they're just going to remain there and just build up their forces and just cause a problem. Now, these guys, can they launch? No, because we still haven't got that. How is he doing? Uh, well, he's just... He's just training up at the moment, isn't he? He's not actually doing both areas. So once he's trained, we'll see if we can actually get him into there. When do we get our next ship? Uh, 21st of January, not too far then. Okay, try and remember that. And we will progress. Um, we've got the justification going on there. That is the 15th of January, so it's all happening hopefully in the right order if it's not happening in the right order i will deal with it all right i would deal with it uh let's get you guys maneuvering that way please now so they've put loads of troops there which is not helpful because i really want to just secure this area and just take it as our own um if you guys can just maneuver up please You provide support for that attack, keep them occupied. See, they're putting everything into there. It's not helpful. It's really not helpful. Okay, we've got the first submarine done. I would like a better submarine than that. Uh, but to do this, I really need to do, well, we're in 1943 now, so I have actually got industrial efforts that I can actually do. Um, okay, I'm going to do that, and I'm going to do that, and then I'll come back to naval stuff when I can. Well, let's remove these from there, and put some support into that, please. Wow, that is loads of troops there. I can actually get into here. You're pinning them down. I mean, that would be good if we could just capture all of those. Uh, they're retreating into that area, so that's going to be even harder to crack. Uh, 
Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, what am I going to do with these? Um, I do really need one to actually just go there, just to protect that territory once we've actually got it. Justification for Mosul is done. Uh, yeah, see, they're all retreating backwards. I didn't really want that. I want to pin them all there if I could, but... Well, let's punish them. Let's punish them. In the meantime, let's get this guy moving and declare war. We won't call in the Allies. We'll do what we did before. And just telling the Third Reich to go and do one. Um, right. Are we still fighting in the area? We are, so we'll carry that on for a while. Uh, yep, yeah, of course, Iraq has joined the Allies. That's not unexpected. Oh, they had to retreat. That's not good. Come on, beat them up. Beat them up and make them go backwards. That's military technology for you. It's not working so well though. It's not working so well. We're probably going to get through there if anything. So let's stop that attack and stop that. Okay, they have got forces there. Yeah, well, we're going to hold on to that. We have the upper hand. He says, as it then goes quiet on the front lines. Can I get in there while they're not looking? Probably not. Uh, I'm not sure why you're attacking there. Troops are moving back from this front line, but that's because I told them to manoeuvre previously. So if I stop them, halt. That is more likely to go first than that. Oops, let's move into there, or there even. I didn't see that. Uh, we could put some support on that, but I'm not going to commit my troops to a major move. If we have any of our majors move into that, it will be under our steam. Okay, how are we doing? We're getting there. Baghdad has fallen already. So... Okay, yep, I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing. Uh, push them back. He says he's got traits. He hasn't. Right, how are we doing elsewhere? The Allies are battling everybody there. Okay, these guys really would like these back here to do something. I don't know, maybe up here and then we'll get them training up because they're crap at the moment uh, naval stuff let's have a look uh, let's get these training up he's repairing last point did I actually get repair queue going on I didn't so I'm not too sure how they're actually repairing mm. Let's get some there. Uh, we could put torpedoes to it, but do really want more torpedoes on that. And we've got a sonar to put on there as well. So, so, no, nah, yeah. Uh, right, move up. Did we have aircraft that we did, didn't we? So let's move them up to there and then they can help support that attack. Is there airfields down here? Not that I can actually see. Hmm. 
Uh, apparently no. Okay, let's get one boogieing that way. Can't believe there's no airfields down on the south of Iran. You've got one airfield, and that's it at Tehran. Okay, fair enough. Is it going to be a problem for us? I don't think so. I'm not too sure why the Western Balkans is kind of an issue, but it seems to be an issue. Uh, right, these guys still don't have that supremacy because we are currently just working in one area, aren't we? Oh, I thought he was actually trained. Obviously not. Okay. Let's forget what we saw there because it's not what we wanted to see. You're moving in, uh, so we'll get you to move in straight behind if we can. And Iraq has capitulated, and I stupidly just diminished everything there, so I didn't actually see what we'd actually got. What a pillock. Um, right, all of your troops are not on there for some reason. So let's... Well, let's move like so. And Blue Troop, um, probably have you guys actually just sit there at the moment. I don't want you to take up supply. Supply! Sorry, terrible joke. Uh, yep, yeah, sure. Uh, let's see if we can widen that. Probably not. I'm thinking if I actually poured my forces back from these areas, would the Germans actually... Uh, I'm saying that, but I'm actually creating a corridor at the moment that hopefully they can get through, and they are, they're following me. So let's see if we can actually pursue this to the coast. And, yep. Oh no, that would be the better one to do. Uh, you get down there. You're moving. Uh, you probably need to move as well. And yeah, okay, sure, do it. Uh, select all, move where you can by rail, heads, and everything else. And let's cut all these lot off because they will not have a port. There's currently no port there. So we need to get in. Uh, right. Half of you lot, stop them. There's no, have no reinforcement from both sides, please. Um, right, okay. What were we doing? Um, well, we need to do that. Uh, I do need to do that, I think. But probably after we've done the research for it. Um, cruiser and a heavy ship. If you don't mind, please. Yep, good, good, good. Although, to be honest, I really wanted my troops actually fighting there. Uh, can I... S well, if we can get into there quicker, that would be better. Or even half of them actually push him back. Don't stop your attack. Can I get in there? Come on, get in there, cut them off. It's less than a day. If we can do this, it would be worthwhile. Come on, continue to hold them. Well done. That is these lot now cut off. And yep, they have got a port, but uh, they haven't got a port. Sorry, they have got a city, a capital city, but they haven't got a port. So 
it really doesn't make any difference whatsoever at this point what the Allies now try and do because that's loads of troops that I don't now have to face on the front line. Thank you very much. Ha ha. Um, naval research. Nuclear effort is coming. Free dockyards. That tells me my naval ships are done because apparently we have got other ships. Okay, they are done. So if we can have them patrol here in just one region, let's see if that makes any difference to this. There is troops there, but depending on how fast they act, we can actually get them maneuvered into places. I think we've lost. Oh no, it's in transit. Okay. Uh, have I got enough to do my submarine yet? I have. I'm dithering. Okay, let's get some submarines. They're really poor, but I think those will suffice at the moment. And we probably will need some more destroyers at this point. Okay, we've got the green light there. We've got the green light there. There is an airfield there. Okay, yes, this is what I figured. Now, can I get a port there? Uh, what I should have done was get some transport planes which he asked for at the same point. One per year, ye gods. Um, wow, okay, that's a bit strange. Uh, that might be something to do with Iraq. Uh, we do need aluminium though, so... Uh, no, hold on. Yugoslavia is not currently on our side, I don't think. Is she France? Yeah, we know that they are. Now, they're not going to get a port there. That's the problem. Until that battle ceases. And then, well, France have decided to put troops there as well. That's not going to work out. That's really not going to work out. Yeah, we need to build that port. How long is it going to take? 38 days. Uh, right, okay. Uh, I think I could actually increase that now because that actually gives us... Uh, no, it doesn't, does it? I th I was thinking for a second, it gives us ports, but it's not, it's a naval base. Oh, damn, and blast. Got anything else that we're actually working on? Uh, no, not really. Okay, so we'll go back to what I was going to do anyway. How many troops have they got there? There's two divisions there, so... We could let those troops actually just take the hit until we get a port there. Or if they just leave us alone for a month, we'll be fine. If we ignore it, if we ignore that front, we'll be fine. Uh, right, he says. Uh, no, take out these. Uh, take out these. Your lot. That's your lot. That's your lot. That's a Charlotte. And that's a Charlotte. And in the meantime, let's move in into places. We've got airfield there, so I can move my aircraft down to her. And we can work on Pakistan, if you don't mind. 
are these actually up there at the same point and they can help there uh righty okay what was i doing uh let's get these training get more points um i could actually improve my Uh, destroyers, I suppose now. There was something on the destroyer that I think we we're missing. I think it was just the hydrophones. If that was the case, then we've got a better destroyer when it comes to it. Whether these destroyers actually remain out there, um, and don't know, because I was expecting to actually use my ships out here. Okay, don't want everybody being run to there, please. All get on there. Uh, right, they have disappeared. They've done a runner. That's fine. In fact, that is really fine because we can now do this and we can go to town on the Raj. Now I want to take in their major cities here so that to me looks like a good front line. Let's push and we're currently getting 2.7k in manpower so um, select all these halt I should just have one or two troops actually moving into these areas, not everybody. Okay, uh, construction stopped on that port. Damn it. Ignorance is not bliss. There's still two divisions there, but we're not getting any supply over there at all. And it'll be a while before we actually get one of these out, I would have thought. Um, yeah, because we our next progress is 29th of August. <laughs> yeah, read it and weep. Sorry guys, yeah, you're going to have to rely on a port that will probably never be built as long as they continue to attack you. Ah, grief. Good idea, but bad idea. You see, we've lost the other troops that are there, and yeah, they're just going to take that back, aren't they? I've sacrificed troops here for no particular reason. I can't even buy them time by giving them an extra fort up there, but uh, we've got combat in this area. Um, I don't think our... I don't think if we put them on naval invasion support that will actually help them. Uh, it does actually. They do get shore bombardment. So, okay. It's still not going to have no effect though on the construction, I don't think, because the area is getting no constructive effort at all. Oh, damn it. Damn it. You win some, you lose a lot. Uh, right. You lot, get on the front lines uh, now. Thank you very much. Do it. We'll try and not look at our troops just disappearing. They are literally just brigades though, and yeah. They've, Swedes have taken back that territory. Damn it. Has that actually cleared the area though? I don't think so. We have got supremacy in both sides of that territory now though. So let's carry that on with our training. Uh, I suppose I could get a bit more training out of them. We've got aircraft actually working in that area. In the meantime, we will do what? We've got naval invasions in Italy, apparently, have we? These guys are still training up. I think they're trained up in North. 
and our manpa is now jumping because we have gone into the Raj and this is now our territory so that was part of the plan and it is still part of the plan uh, right we want you to start snakings uh, sirs uh, get to Lahore no jokes please no jokes and go through the back entrance to Delhi uh, you could go to Yapur you can help him by clearing that uh, who's actually not moving into enemy territory that would be him okay do it right now kind of want these troops to maneuver uh, over this area here if we can get them doing that and I think we could actually ask for yeah that's fine we could ask for some more divisions probably we've got artillery um, we haven't got enough tanks to actually do a light tank division although it would be nice but yes we could actually do some more of these And get them on the go. Oops. They can deploy there. Uh, yeah, we can't do a lot about this, not yet. In fact, I'm not too sure, apart from sending my main troops over, I don't think we can actually do that. If I get proper naval invasion support, Maybe I could, just, could send my main troops in. In the meantime, we're going to get these guys trained up because we have got submarines and cruisers and main... What do they call them? Heavy ships? Do we want to get in there? Well, that is a lot of forces they've put into Delhi. But we are getting in there uh, with the help of the Germans. Don't tell them that, that they're actually helping us out. They want the war score. They're not getting it. They're not getting it. Um, right, not sure why you are not actually taking these bits of territory. Again, is that a fuel silo? I think it is. Let's push in between the rivers because you'll have defense on both sides there please. In the meantime what are we doing here? We're waiting for Blue Troop to actually get his act together and get on this front line. Right our air forces are going to be struggling now with trying to get to where they need to be. So can we have them now deploy there? Uh, there on the armies. Okay. This is Northern India. Northern India, that's fine. Need these guys to maneuver to do that when it comes to it. Um, I could actually increase some of these. The will. I think that's probably a few too many that I really wanted to do. Uh, fighters, I've no idea. I think we're short of fighters completely, so. We're going to have to get production up on. The, whoa, 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 whoa. That was way too many. I'm just guessing now. Not do 
everybody has got an increase on that. That's the way we want them. Okay, um, back to reality. And yeah, let's get an early heavy ship haul because we're going to need to put quite a few things on those. Naval experience is gaining, but it will be slow. Okay, there. They should stop because I've got them on that order to do the naval exercises, but then stop. So hopefully they actually pay attention. Uh, his front line currently is Crapula, so let's try and do something with that. And I've just seen where their capital now lies, so there we go, down in Bombay. And push. Come on, Blue Troop. Yeah, you don't really need to be all doing that. Push in. You have got your separate orders after all. Well done, you've cut these guys off. Get those. Doing that. You get on there. In fact, you can get on there because you're all for some reason going to the wrong front lines. Idiots. Yeah, we don't want four divisions on there. It's not necessary. Just wipe these out. They're fine, they'll get to where they need to be. Um, right, early cruise is done. Right, a better cruiser or do we start doing naval doctrines? I think naval doctrines just give us for our submarines and light cruisers and heavy cruisers. So we'll do that to start off with. Can we actually influence our naval stuff anymore? Don't think so. Um, we could do aviation stuff now to actually help us out. Paramilitarism is also good for training time. That only helps us out when we've got on our core territory. It does give us an extra 5% war support. Hmm. I'm going to delay that. Um... Doctrine effort we don't need to do. That would be good. We haven't done any infantry stuff, I don't think, at all this episode. Right, that's telling me that we need to increase our weapons on these, but I don't think I can actually do that, not yet. I think the minimum that you need has not been met. Yeah, we see we've only got 17, so how much are we going to need? For a light cruiser? Twenty-five at least. Probably thirty. Uh, I'm not fussed about you walking up the front lines like that. That is a bad move. Just get over there instead. Uh, again, don't do that. Do that. And... Oh, hold on. That's into those, isn't it? That is a bad move. I would like to be able to move into there, but you're going to do the same either way at the moment. Unless we cut our losses there and then have you guys do that. Maybe. Right, aim to do that, get behind them. Arm 
loving this manpower. Loving this manpower. But now we've got 4.15 thousand per month because we're just getting into these areas of the Raj. It's kind of good. So do remember this. Uh, you're going in there, okay. Um, fine. Right. Research speed would be helpful, I suppose, for everything. How are we doing on time? Well, we're, we're there. We're more than there, aren't we? Uh, what's going on in Italy? Because we are coming back to our holiday homes again. Uh, looks if these guys could actually do something there, which contain those. We've got the Brits trying it on there, which is fine, I suppose. It's not really. Uh, when did we get our new troops? 1943, uh, 20th of November. Okay. It's a while then. Well, I quite agree. If I'd done that other focus, I could have just gone and taken them a lot quicker. But I didn't. So don't hassle me. I'm not the Hoff. Okay, that is good. Streamline, so that's going to give us more equipment faster. Up to 1 million manpower. About time. I know what you're thinking. It's about bloody time. Um, yeah, that would also be good. Uh, that gives us rocket sites, but it's kind of these that I really want. We haven't got our rocket uh, artillery in our troops not yet bought uh, I suppose that will come at some point it's gonna have to come at some point if we're gonna take on the Americans I feel there's an there's an essence there that we're kind of missing really uh, yeah I'm not sure why you're doing that you should actually be just maneuvering outflank these people and what is this is it resistance enemy has supremacy in yep yeah, that's understandable really but these guys really do need to move up have I got an airfield to put them on uh, yes and these maybe gonna be a bit of a push that I don't think we've got any aircraft that are no we have got cars though so let's increase the cars on both of those uh, yeah, those fighters, I do really need to do something about my fighter production because it is absolutely crap. But as you can see, we do need other things. So it's all swings and roundabouts. I suppose that would help. That is red groups, so they just need to move up. In the meantime, we will, as you can see, the Raj is a bit like Russia in the respect of just loads of territory, but they haven't got enough manpower to defend it all. So once you get in there, once you start that ball rolling, if you can carry that momentum on, it will just carry on. You just need to find your way through or around the troops. Um, right, we've got naval doctrine going on, sir. So uh, we're going to be pursuing the submarine. Um, oh, hold on. Have I done this yet? 
that would be good to do that also would be good to do I think we ought to do that okay there's loads of territory there that's just being wasted at the moment Could we get into there? Cut these off then. They're trying to attack, uh, counter-attack anyway. And the United Kingdom has, has called Yugoslavia as our enemy. Interesting. Have we got any troops around there? Uh, well, funny enough, they're launching invasions from there, so that actually helps us out, I suppose. And Italy hasn't really. Um, I would have used my. Ooh, hold on, that's interesting. I would, I would have used my troops on this side, really, but I haven't really got them to spare. Are we defending there? Uh, I think we are. Do we really need to defend? I think probably the Axis forces will have the advantage here. I'm not sure about this. This is a bit dodgy. Let's get in there. Says he's got a trait. It's lying. Yeah, I do apologize. We're back in Italy again. Am I being sponsored by Italy? No. Considering they have no port, they're doing well. And the United States has broken our codes. <laughs> Did we have any? Okay, I'm not sure what's actually going on there, but that seems to be a bit of a blip. Um, that's good to see though. Where are Italy dropping the ball elsewhere? Probably here. Yep, they are. Should just form a line. If they can't take the territory, form a line. Instead, no, they're just backing troops up all the way along. That's because the computer doesn't know what to do. Well, I'm giving it opportunities here of what to do. Okay. Um, so, one of you guys in there... Okay, you're already doing that. One of you in there. I'm not sure why you're wanting to go up there. Because that's particularly weird. Uh, you do that and then come and attack these. You can get in there. And you could probably attack over that river. I don't really want you to do that, but you're moving through so let's do that in fact we could do that instead and take that territory there okay bombay has not fallen yet why not okay where were we I think we should be fine here but it's just disconcerting when you see that their troops have actually got all that supply there and are lasting out when they've got no port no city no nothing uh that is uh, okay there was an invasion going on there and now isn't sneaky gonna have to watch stuff like that uh what's going on up here we've still got Ships being trained up. Okay, they can now go to there. Okay, let's have that one repair because for some reason it's. These will be our destroyers. And we have got British ships out here. There's. Interesting. There is. There is capital ships out here. Oh, no, no, there isn't. 
No, there is. We have got allied ships there. How? I have no idea. Interesting. Um, okay. We really need the Axis forces to actually get into this area with their ships. Uh, let's accept that. For some reason, we've got a problem with artillery. Have we? Well, we yeah, I suppose we have. Um, infantry equipment's not brilliant either, to be fair. We will get military factories come along those, so it's not a problem. We'll get there. Is that because we've taken some hits, maybe? Not sure. Northern India, yep, yeah, okay. Uh, but that is just invasions of other people's territory. It's not our own. Okay, Bombay is now in our hands. Just get in there, please. And you can help support that. Get in there. You could start pushing him back. Along with those. Okay, we've cornered all those troops up there and eliminated what remained. So, Red Group, you now need to find yourselves on this border, and you are. So, let's get on there quicker than chaps. I probably agree with that front line though, because it has moved quite dynamically and we need to move to Calcutta now in fact we'll do that because that will red group will move there and blue group will move to there push we've got points and points make prizes uh, Chief of Navy, that might help, I suppose. Uh, I'm going to do that at the moment because it's going to be necessary at some point. Uh, what have we got going on here? Just move in all the way down this way, Jabs. Why have we got to cross the river, honestly? Not sure. More invasions in Italy. Seriously? I'm not sure. I think we ought to back off this area again. If we come away from that and then just put our troops, well, I don't know where, but somewhere where they're going to be probably a bit more useful than what they're doing at the moment, like that. We'll let the Axis forces actually deal with all of this nonsense going on there. And we'll pursue the Raj. Let's see if we can actually force our way in. Yugoslavia's capitulated. Nice. What well, for us? Nice. More equipment effort, uh, mechanization, sure, let's do that. Uh, let's see if we can grab some tanks. Um, right, you guys, I don't know what you're doing, but get to here. Right, and tell this guy to push really hard now, because they are... Sorry? I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. The Germans are requesting garrison support off us. We're going to give them absolutely nothing. Remember, uh, Mammal? We will take that off you, though, Bulgaria. Thank you very much. <laughs> it's all swings and roundabouts. 
Right, you guys just go around the houses and you'll find that there is gaps. Malaya has capitulated. It's good for us, which means the Japanese are expanding. Okay, slight difference of colour the last time we left this, because I think uh, Japan actually, didn't they lose this? I have no idea now. Oh my god, I'm not going to try not looking at China, because it's just a mess. Uh, right, that would also be good, but what are we doing? Oh, we haven't done that one yet. Should we continue doing our submarine effort? Well, that would be good to do anyway. Submarines and really good torpedoes as we just get into Bangalore. I mean, seriously, the timing on that is awesome. Yep, go around. And if you get into there, you just cut these off and you create the line that I do want. Yeah, literally, there's a couple of divisions actually stopping us from just snaking through. <laughs> and funny enough, the German Reich says, no, we're cancelling your land lease then. You're not going to give us what we want. We'll not give you what you want. Yeah. And stuff you as well. walking around with stupid moustaches. I don't know. Um, okay, not sure really what's gone on there. We have... We have a slight issue there. <laughs> right, all of you lot, back on there. Stick to your own bloody things. Uh, Blue group, I don't want you all... <laughs> Seriously, you had to take it from there. Seriously, you had to. Right, let's... Oh, hold on. No, let's do it like this. And then we'll have these guys on there. Uh, not like that. Oh, honestly. Let's do it like that then, and then we'll do that one again. I think that's going to just mess it up completely. Uh, no, that's a red line continuously all the way along there. That's fine then. That's fine. Get into there. That's where I want you to go. Push. Um, you guys don't know where to go yet. I'm going to tell you in a second. Your job is to do all of that and get on it. Go. Do. And red group are still moving in the right direction, which is always helpful. Nope. All of you lot, just there please. Just there. The Raj has got to be, I was going to say, they've got to be close to falling there, 89% towards capitulation. So we're up to 2.05 million men in the manpower pool. And no wonder um, why the um, Germans were actually asking. That's why, because our manpower is probably more than theirs at the moment. Uh, what have we got going on? We've got the Axis beating these to a pulp. Good. Uh, not a lot going on there. Good. Yugoslavia is now under Italy's control. Okay. And we are all fine and dandy. We just need to put this one to bed. Honestly. Seriously, you guys. You do really just naff me off. you could go around you don't when I want you to go through you don't do you do any orders that I want correctly no I usually the fall of Hong Kong that is another good thing for us and well if it was modern day it probably would be a good thing really
They're not having a good time of it at the moment, are they? Right, Calcutta is ours. So there we go. Have we got any armored cars? That's the only thing I'm really interested in at the moment. Um, no, but we've got one fighter. Well, we managed to grab a fighter on the ground. Oh, no, two. I do apologize. Uh, there is 48 of fighter ones. And there's 55 hawker hearts. Okay, not sure what I'm going to do with them. But the Dominion of India is now in our pocket. And as you can see, we own, well, all of that so far. So, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. The Japanese managed to get that. Look, kids. Okay. Um, I'm not sure what we can actually do about that. Uh, that is going to be a future Oz that has to sort that out. Uh, we have still got invasions of Italy going on. Seriously, how are they able to get into here? This territory now should be off limits to them. But, well, it appears no, because the Italians haven't got a navy to put into there. So, okay. What we need now is the Germans and the Italians to actually move across North Africa, close the Mediterranean off. Or do we? Do we allow it to continue so they keep on expending their troops across the Atlantic? And if we can get some submarines out here, we'll sink them out here. Yep. Let's just fill those ocean trenches with troop ships. Nasty, but nice. Well, nice for us anyway in the game. Uh, right. Hope you liked that episode. Hope you join me for the next one. Um, I have no idea what's next. I'm going to have to put my thinking cap on because... Yeah, because... <laughs> um... I haven't taken all the territory there, champs. I hope you've not left that on purpose, because you're idiots. Uh, right, while they continue to sort themselves out in India, three million men we will have to invade maybe China and then go for Canada, Mexico, United States, or Britain. One or the other. Okay, we're going to have to decide. If you've got any ideas, let me know. It's going to be a week before I do the next episode, so you'll see this on Sunday afternoon-ish. Uh, yeah, leave a comment if you want. If you want to see a particular thing happen. Uh, otherwise, join me for the next one. Like, comment, subscribe if you'd like to, and I'll see you next time. See you later. Bye.